Boop, 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 ba -doop, boop, do, 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 do. To the Sand Kingdom we go for its race and trying to find Princess Peach as well. This is this is this is the main, the main side quest of the game. Yes, Ca yes, Cappy, we've had that rock all over the place. I believe I believe Princess Peach is actually at the top of the inverted pyramid, if I'm remembering correctly. But also look at all the the Severians are also here too. That's an odd place to be. You think they you think they would swelter this heat? But this is cool about the the post game stuff where there's just you know a lot like all the play people we've met are basically now in multiple different places. Like they're all wearing the same hats. Why can't we go inside? Oh, you're not wearing the you're not wearing the right suit, you know. You have to wear the right attire if you want to go dance. Let's see here. Oh, this is a why is it's an Arcappy character? Hmm? You found me, but, but but how? I was so well hidden. I'll give you this if you keep me from my hiding secret. Hat and seek in the sand. Yeah, there's uh, around the kingdoms. There are going to be these uh, these two you know, captains here. They're all like, "Where's our friend? Where's our friend?" We lost track of him, so you need to go find. So you need to go find another cappy person, which we just did there. So we did that earlier. So let's see. There's Luigi's over there too. Mario, help! I'm floating. No, I can't help you. I have to go find the princess. I believe the princess is at the top here. I think she's on top of the inverted pyramid, if I'm thinking that correctly. But also in the post-game stuff, we can now get up here pretty easily. I think she's, she has to be up here. I believe she's up here. I'm questioning the thing is? I think she, I thought she was up here. I think that's weird if I can't find her. But there's a moon there apparently. Well, we found another moon. Why not? It's on the tail. Found a new one. Huzzah! All right, click the moon. And I thought she was up here. Maybe she's somewhere else. I don't recall where she. I thought she was up here. Yeah, she is. Yeah, I was right. <laughs> There she is. She blends in so well. And this is like her dress outfit. Like her vacationing out dress. You think this huge stone thing could float? This world is full of wonders. How does it float? Why is it inverted? So mysterious. I haven't even found a power moon in the sand. Take good care of it. Alright. We're finding her all over the place. I was thinking about this place. The beautiful flower fields. I had to go see them again. That means she's looking for the steam gardens. So, yeah. <laughs> we'll have to go back there next to her and find her there. But meanwhile, race time! Yes, yeah, so we're going to go after the races. After the whole horror thing that was the Cascade Kingdom, kind of messed up the fact that, you know, uh, <laughs> we need to have the uh, the moon rock broken for the Master Cup to show up. <laughs> Alright, we're in the rolling races. We've traveled the globe facing every kingdom we can get to. Want to race? Sure. This is, and also, this race also happens at night, too. Which is nice, because you don't get to see the Sand Kingdom at night after the initial story. So you have to race back to town. Now, this would be... Now, Now the game makes you want to run, but I think it's, I think it's faster if you actually just go by lightning. Because there's so, because this lightning is like a direct route back to home. I think. I hope I don't fail this badly. So we gotta go here. And this takes us all the way back to first. I'm gonna run down like here. I'm like so far in first now, which is quite a shock, actually. Booyah! There we go! Another mo another race down and dusted. There's the red guy. Let's dive. Pratfall. <laughs> Pratfall to the floor. Blazing fast, bro. Here's the prize. Power moon. Yeah. 
We're going to try the same setup again for the Magic Cup and see if it does any better. You got any racer? We're up. Let's do this. More races, more fun for more moons, folks. Let's go get it. And I still like the Sand Kingdom at night. I wish you could switch between on, on the fly, you know, between sand, light and, or day and night. But you can't. It's really a shame, too, because I feel like some of these places at night are really cool looking. There we go. And the Koopas are riding on the lightning. I like that. It's like, ooh, he's going up that way. Right, let's go this way. Come on, baby. Huzzah! You can use a Jaxi if you so choose. But I find out the Jaxi is a little bit sh uh, slower as well. So I find this is actually, I think, the fastest route. So like that. Booyah! That's all! Booyah! Oh, barely, just barely did it. <laughs> that was close, folks. Very close indeed. Yeah, Pratt falls to the floor. I'm the master racer of the Sand Kingdom now. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Sand Kingdom Master Cup done and dusted. Let's see. Where can most be? Oh, there's actually several couple of moons over here. Might as well. Sorry, Jaxi. Did not mean to run into you. Uh, let's see. There is something over here? It says there's one right here in the distance. Oh. Oh, this is, oh, it's the one to take out the, the posters down. I think that's what it is. Yeah, I've taken down the posters. Who put up these posters? They're an eyesore. Lighting, littering up the place. <laughs> so you have to take all the posters down. You could have done this earlier, but you got no reward for it. But if you do it now, you get a power moon for your trouble, so... It's worth it. <laughs> we got clear up this place. Yeah, the wedding was a sham, <laughs> and the wedding was off. <laughs> so we need to clear up the all these advertisements and everything. I could just get up there. <laughs> there we go. That's a little tricky to hit. Just need to get Cappy there and knock these posters off. There we go. It's, you know, it's, it's, I find it weird how posters are just stuck there. This is because you can only really. I don't really like the tacking posters onto the walls, like with like tape or anything of that sort. Because you all know that t that tape is never coming off, and if you rip the tape off, well, there goes your poster. So <laughs> we need to find a better way to stick, you know, to have a poster stick to the walls better. Than just having using scotch tape or anything. Oh, this is a goom. Oh, there's a goomba out here. And I think the only goomba is right at the start. So you have to make a huge trek over there, just for that moon entirely. Oh yes, the trace walking. Yeah, that's gonna be a fun little adventure. <laughs> yeah. Also, the fact that the uh, the moon the the moon rocks also add a new uh, trace walking. Which I think you have to get 90 points or more to actually, you know, survive or actually get it. So, by all accounts, it is a fun, it's a nice little distraction, but it's very difficult, especially on later levels. There we go. Here's a new guy, we can, a new place we can go to. This, one, this one's a little trickier. I think there's any over here? No. But this one's a little, this one's a little, a little tricky because there is a platform down there. Which, uh, where's it go? Oh, there's a moon down, there's a key down there. Right. But we need to fall onto that platform so we can see where it is. No! That is way too early on that one. Been a lot of deaths lately in this session, already. <laughs> No, Mario, why'd you do that for? <laughs> Mario, you need to stop dying all over the place. That'd be great. <laughs> okay. I gotta find where this place is because there's a moon right inside that lock. <laughs> okay. We're gonna try this easier now. <laughs> We're gonna be easier on this one. 
There we go. Now this platform will come back this way. We'll grab the key, which allows us to get that moon. Bump, 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 bump. Hey! Now we go back up here. And we get ourselves that power moon. And now for the real one. <laughs> the real challenge this time around now. Now we have to get across this place with, with little to no effort now. But again, you have to take off the sunglasses if you need to have uh, move faster on these platforms. Which again, I'm glad this game has a lot of has a lot of post game stuff. Even though really all of it, you don't have to do it. All this is optional if you so choose. You know. Well, we got a moving platform. We got to make sure we can move faster. Oh boy, almost fell off. That would have been bad. Just take off the glasses when you feel like you can get away with it. So, bear that in mind. Also, you can't jump in this form, so... You're just gonna have to be quick-like. Or you can just do that and hope for the best you don't fall on the... Okay, we're trying this the hard mode. Oh boy. There's a wall? Okay, we're gonna have to... Wow, that moon's in the air. <laughs> um, okay. This is... Okay. <laughs> Alright, got it? Woo! Okay, good. Woo! <laughs> that was close, folks. That was very close. Alright, that's, that's the hard version of that pipe done and done with. Let's see, what else? Actually, I think I'm good on there. We got the two, we got the moons we want, which is the Racing and Princess Peach. It's time we head off to the next kingdom of sorts. Dun 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 dun! Doo, we're done here! Off to the Steam Kingdom! We have 484. We're gonna make it! <laughs> and again, we've made a milestone. More stuff is being added to the shop as we see fit. Alright. With that said, we're off to the Wood Kingdom. Oddly enough, Princess Peach is not in the Dark Woods. She's in the she's in the upper and she's in the upper ranges of it. So that's always good to know. As we get up here to the Wood Kingdom now, I love how the trees just fade in on and out, but like that. But whatever. Yes, Cappy, we've seen that. <laughs> Yeah, every kingdom we come across, Cappy's gonna mention, Hey, there's a rock right there that's cracked. Maybe we should break it. <laughs> Cappy, I don't think we should break, you know, artifacts, you know, anywhere. You know, that'd be kind of bad and irresponsible. <laughs> but you're the boss. <laughs> Booyah. All right, the new rocks here. We get more moons for our trouble. Now, I think Princess Peach is on the very top of this place. So it actually makes it very easy to find her at. At least I believe she's up here. If not, then you know I'm mis misinterpreting it at all. But we got more moons to collect. We also have the race that's here too. Also the merfolk are here too. That flesh will be the flower theme. This place is so inspiring. My, I wanted to connect our network to the roads here. My efforts are haphazard. <laughs> Alright, let's get up here. Up to the top. And I... Yep, yep, she's up here. Right there, and she's in the explorer outfit. The flowers in this game are so lovely. I wonder how they grow them. I have never seen so many flowers. The power moon popped out of a flower. I hope that helped in your travels. Dun, 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 dun. Woo! Well, we got that moon taken care of. I'm gonna have people in that underwater town spend their days. Maybe I'll ask them. Looks like she's gonna head off into the uh, the Lake Kingdom next, which is all nice and dandy. Let's see what the, we got for the flowers in this place. Let's see if the boss really has anything for us here. I'm pretty sure there is. Let's go after him. Huzzah! I think there is something here we can do. As I thought there was, maybe I am misinterpreting it. Yes, I am. Okay, never mind. 
I thought there'd be another moon down here. But no, we've already cleared that moon out, so... Off we go to the next uh, area. Let's see, where is... Let's see what this does. Let's see what this pipe takes us. Oh, yes. Again, if you want the poison variant of the prawn plant, this is the way to do it. If you haven't gotten the fire one yet already. No, oh, Cappy, I want you out of the fire. fire. There you go. Well, I didn't mean to crack the rock. <laughs> oh, whatever. There we go. You really want to keep the poison on as much as possible. There we go. Now I've captured that. We can now put poison everywhere, but that's just going to hinder us altogether. We're going to die here because I don't get a heart. Okay. I'm going to need some coins. There's a secret area over there. I can see it. But yeah, this place is all about hidden platforms. You just have to watch out for the poison to do you in. Coins don't heal you, unfortunately. Oh man, that's a close that was a close shot. <laughs> Woo! Invisible road, the hidden room, baby. We got our we got our life back too while we're at it. Sweetness. Now let's see if I can get Now I think they're expecting you to do is to, you know, capture the piranha plant and then and then actually you now make the road appear before you, but you can do it without doing it, because the platforms are already here. You know, you just got to just take the hit, as it were. Oh yeah. I think we have to take out the rest of these piranha plants here. Oh yeah. Take care of you. And oh yeah. And that gets us our next moon, folks. Boom ya! The invisible road, danger! Well, we got that one down. No worries there. We're out of here. Let's go find the race. <laughs> we're doing races in this one, folks, because we're doing all the races. I want to, though, if that's the case. Uh, let's see, where is the race located? The Koopa Free Running is down there. Let's go after him. Bum, 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 ba, dum, bum, boom! This one can be a little crazy, I think, if, if I'm remembering correctly. I think you have to do a really weird dive jump in order to actually beat it under a certain amount of time. Because we have to go through the 2D section, or you can try to go around it by basically doing a huge, risky jump. Yeah, that's right, it's this one. You have to get over there! No, nothing too hard, right? Let's go! That's all. Just jump like this. Ignore the falling damage. Or the... Make sure you have the right timing for it. Come on, Mario. Jump. There we go. Now we want to do this. We want to do a really precise... Long jump, no! Mario! <laughs> well, so much for that. Retry! <laughs> I'm having a horrible time tonight, folks. <laughs> it's a very precise jump if you make it. And you can do it, and I think it is actually is fully required to actually beat this one with the master in mind. Oop. Come on, baby. Triple jump up there. You just gotta do some lot of good platforming. Huzzah! Alright, now let's try this without actually failing this time. There we go. Got that done. Jump up and down and all around, and we get to finish that race, baby. Huzzah! Ba -ba -ba -ba! A new record. <laughs> well, Alvin's gonna be a new record, Mario. Power Moon is ours! Booyah! Alright, let's do the Master Cup. 
Let's do this bad boy. Master Cup is a go, baby! Let's hope I don't fail it this time. <laughs> Course still applies. In order basically to beat this, you have to do this long jump, I think. Because I think the Golden Koopa will basically do exactly what he wants, and that is to basically to shortcut his way to victory. So, shortcut yourself. <laughs> Right there, wait for the pistons to come up. Just keep wall jumping to victory. Like that. Come on, Mario. Climb up there. there we go. Right, let's do this bad boy. Jump like that. Booyah! Perfectly. Two times in a row. Booyah! Dun, 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 dun. Boo! Yeah! There's the golden guy. Pratfall! <laughs> Pratt fall to the floor. <laughs> Power Moon is ours, baby. Let's ah. Little Kingdom Master Cup is ours. All right, let's move on to the next kingdom. Again, we're doing it. these are all going to be like quick revisits because we're almost to 500 moons and would like to get to every kingdom what post game we can. Did I actually get the thing here? I don't think I did. Actually, come think of it. We got 42 of the coins left. Might as well see what we can get out of them. Let's see, do we actually get everything that's here? Yes, we did. Except for we're missing three coins just so we can get the outfits for them. Look at that. We already got the sticker for this place. Alright, nothing more tagging dinner dialing around. It is time to go to the next kingdom. Let's go. And I believe this is going to be the Lake Kingdom we're going to next. Because Princess Peach mentioned that she's going to the Lake Kingdom next, so why not? To the Lake Kingdom we go. Right in line of where we're going next, baby. Huzzah!